Hey guys, it's Coach B, and uh, like I told you, every single day, I'm uh, bringing to you my thoughts on uh, nutrition, fitness, and just, you know, my perspective on life as a result to wellness and well-being. Uh, today, instead of actually espousing my knowledge, I'm actually going to ask for some help. So, here's what I know. Um, like many Americans, uh, I suffer from back pain. And a lot of times my back pain is not from injury, but it's from the amount of muscular trauma I put on myself during my workouts. So, what I do all the time is I warm up, I include uh, mobility exercises, stretching, and uh, just a general dynamic warm up. So, doing movements that are uh, kind of what I'm gonna be doing in the workout that day. But, one of the muscle groups that I've become uh, keenly aware of lately is my piriformis. And I could be saying that wrong, but it's one of the butt muscles. It's kind of deep inside the butt. And, uh, it's that making it one of the harder muscles to stretch. So, here's my question to my PT friends out there. Um, I want you to take a look at these three ways of stretching the piriformis and tell me what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong, and which one is the best. So, here's the first one. This is the one I know of so far. It's laying, it's a supine piriformis stretch. You lay on your back, you go into the foot cradle position, okay, and then I grab behind my knee and pull and sometimes because I need it more I'll grab my outside of my knee and pull ah. and that gets in there and I hold that for about 30 seconds now another one that I've become aware of is one sitting up like this where you cross your knees like you're doing a crawl and you place this hand to the outside and lean over ah. that gets in there Okay, so that's two. Now, here's the third one. And this one, really, I did it on my own. It's probably wrong, but I feel this one also. So, I go up on my foam roller, go in the leg cradle position again, and then I'll roll until I find that stretch position. And hold that. So, again, my question is to my PT friends out there. What was I doing right? What was I doing wrong? And if you'd be so kind as to leave a comment and, you know, tell the people watching way more about the piriformis and why this stretch in particular is important because obviously I'm incapable of doing so. So, thanks very much. This is Coach B. Uh, you find me online at www.eatingforabs.com, the ultimate nutrition course, and uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Take care.